How's it going, everybody? This is Chewy, one of the hosts of the podcast titled Explore in the Mids Behind the Legends. And I had a question on Twitter the other day. We were doing a Twitter space with another podcast titled Next on Stage One. And by the way, do check them out, they are awesome. But I was able to record the audio from that space meeting, if you want to call it, interview. And they asked me how I was able to do that. And I'm not a professional audio recorder. I mean, I have some background in music recording and my podcast editing, of course. But I do know that well, this is the way that works for me. <laughs> so what I need is a sound source from the Twitter. And this is a non-functional iPhone 6. Uh, sadly, the battery is dead, so I, I can't turn it on anymore. But I'm going to show you what I do with this in a couple minutes and I also have my outside sound recorder which is this thing here it's actually a video camera but I've been using it primarily to capture the audio from my co-host who is in a different location than I am so we meet up on Skype or Zoom and I record the sound from the computer into this thing and I'll explain that in a minute too I got some cables here I don't have a third cable that's also kind of popular for this purpose but uh, it's not very important and I'll show you why. So essentially what you want to do is you want to run your Twitter space app or phone call or any kind of a conference app or thing you're using and you're gonna run that from your phone's headphone connection right there. That would be how the sound comes out. So you're talking to somebody here on Twitter or Snapchat or anything Instagram live maybe even I've done that before by the way also <laughs> and you want to capture your audio from here with this cable into this which is an outside sound recorder there are a couple different ones that uh, I don't have available but I'll put some pictures in, in the meantime like in the video itself as I am explaining this so what I do is I have this cable here that's uh, 1 8 inch connection or a 3.5 millimeter connection whichever you prefer and this goes and splits up into a stereo two quarter inch connections which are these right here that's a, a pretty cool cable because it lets me capture the audio in stereo and I can edit it and make it sound a lot better than it actually does when you capture it the other cord that I don't have would be the traditional aux cord which is just this and then the cable and then the other end is just like this so it's two 1 8 inch connections or two 3.5 millimeter connections so what I do is when I am in a phone call or a Twitter space or li Instagram live or something like that I connect my cable here as that meeting or conversation is going on and that lets the sound from that go out and then I connect that to my sound device right here like that and that is how I'm able to record the sound from here sorry about the light <laughs> into here and this green port right here is for my headphones I do like to listen to myself <laughs> on headphones not because I'm uh, an egotistical person which eh, I guess I am I'm a Leo <laughs> if you believe in astrology but I can hear the conversation a lot better, a lot clearer. I can hear myself as I'm speaking. And what I can do here, I hope I'm charged a little bit at least here with the battery thing. Okay, yeah, it's, it's dying and my SD card is not there, but I don't need that for now. So essentially, I don't, it's a little hard to see, but mm, let's see there. Okay, so I'll try to get it closer. Okay, so oh, sorry about the ca cam movement. I have it on a tripod here, and it's like. So, what I'm doing is. I don't know if you can see. You probably can't. There's some lines there. But are indicating that my microphone here. Is capturing noise. And that's how I capture my voice. I capture my voice into this. Actually, it's a different mic that I have. But um, it looks a little weird. <laughs> so, essentially, this mounted microphone that comes with the camera, or this sound device that I have let me record myself into here and then the like I mentioned the phone over here with this cable lets me connect whatever the other people are saying 
And the cool thing about doing it like this is that I can edit the levels in my sound software. So if the conversation that's coming from the phone is too loud, I can always change the volume levels right here. I have two little volume settings there for the two connections. I can actually make one louder than the other if I had to, but that's not really something that's practical because it's just going to make your job a lot harder. So I kind of keep them about the same, the same level. And then I can also regulate my volume on this microphone here, there, so I can make myself louder than everybody else and, and dominate the conversation. <laughs> not really, just it helps me level the, the volumes. Because I've noticed sometimes in some podcasts, the one of the hosts or, or the people that are speaking sounds a little bit louder than the others, or quite a bit louder sometimes than the other. And the cool thing about doing it like this is that I can regulate the volumes from my voice with this, their voices with this, and if I need to do any further editing, which I usually do because, I mean, this thing's pretty cool, but I can still go into my sound software and add sound effects and stuff like that to make it sound a little more, more polished. Not professional, because I'm, again, I'm not at that level, but yeah. So that's how it lets me do that. And I was going to show you this cable too, because um, if you notice, this ending is different than the ones here. And let's go ahead and unplug this for now. And I'm going to show you that I can do the same thing with this cable, which is, it's a little bit different. It's an angled eighth inch connection. So I just plug it in the same way that I would with the other one. And then this connection over here, which is called an XLR connection. There's a male and a female. This one happens to be a male because there's got little prongs there sticking out. So that would also be a XLR female port. Not only a quarter inch port, but also an XLR female port. So I can connect my thing here. There. Now, this only lets me record in one channel in mono. Which is also cool, but I think stereo sounds a little bit better when it comes from, from this right here. That's just my preference. I mean, I could technically double this up in my sound software and, and edit it and make it sound stereo if I had to, or if I wanted to. This is kind of another solution. I mean, if you're kind of like in a hurry or, or you lost your other cable or something like that. I mean, this works pretty much the same way, except it's going to sound a little different. That's going to be the only thing. You can use either one. This happens to be the one that I have. There are other ones that don't have these ports. And um, turn it off because I don't need that anymore. It's kind of hard to see anyways, but... Um, yeah, so some sound recorders don't have these ports right here. And again, I'm going to put some pictures on, on the video. They would have something similar to this green one. Probably a different color, like yellow, white, or red. More than likely red or white, because yellow, I think, is video. But, yeah, so you would connect the other cord that I don't have, which is just your traditional aux cord, which is two of the other connections that we have here. So both ends of the aux cord look like this. The ones that you might have used in your car, for example, to plug in your phone before the days of Bluetooth. <laughs> so you would connect one end of this here to your phone. Like that, like we've been doing so far. And then the other end, which looks similar to this, or just like this, would go into the other port, not the headphone port. You don't want to do that. You do not want to do that because that's going to mess up your device, probably. <laughs> uh, you're going to cause a second big bang or something <laughs> maybe not something that but that's essentially that's that's the wrong connection you don't want to connect it, this coming from that into a headphone connection because that's gonna no it's not gonna work what they would have instead of that like i said it's another port that looks like this where i can plug this in and it's going to be called a line in connection so a line in And you would connect, again, your phone into that, and it's the same thing. It would just capture the audio from your phone or device into your sound recorder. So, 
I hope that was kind of clear enough well, for you guys. <laughs> Again, I'm not a very tech savvy person, but I've been able to figure this out because of my background and, and sound recording and stuff like that. So hopefully this helps you out. If it does, awesome. If it doesn't, do let me know. Ask me some questions. I can try to help you out and clear some of that stuff for you. And uh, yeah, so we'll see you in the next one. And until then, have a good one.